Hello everyone, and welcome to my young and restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Jack might provide information about Diane Jenkins Abbott's termination, expulsion, and request for an annulment. Billy will back Jack because he doesn't need to be fighting with him on top of everything else. Naturally, there is a chance for an alliance here since Jack and Billy will also discuss their shared complaints over Victor Newman. When it comes to facing the mustache, Billy and Jack might decide to support one another. Is the situation with Jack and Diane's broken marriage as severe as it seems? It all feels like one extremely intricate fake, even though Y and R is trying to sell this abrupt breakup. Diane and Jack might need to use every trick in the book if they wish to deceive Victor and Kyle Abbott. This includes misleading individuals along the road, such as Billy and Tracy Abbott. In any case, Victor will come up with a fresh revenge plot for Friday's Y and R episode. Victor would then develop a plan to entice Diane to join his team and take advantage of her resentment toward Jack. Diane might soon find herself feigning to assist Victor while really assisting Jack and Jabbit if the marital drama is all a phony out. Keep an eye out for any difficult news in the future, as our forecasts suggest that Diane and Jack may face some difficulties. Let's then discuss Phyllis Summers and the issues she will attempt to resolve on behalf of Daniel Romolati Jr. Daniel's reputation will be restored by Phyllis, but he may be in hot water for some time due to Sharon Newman's frame-up. Sharon, on the other hand, will need to figure out how to either change Phyllis's direction or get rid of her completely. If Sharon made the decision to completely remove Phyllis from the picture, it wouldn't be shocking. According to previews for The Young and the Restless, Sharon will go extreme steps to conceal her sinister Heather Stevens secrets. Given that Daniel is currently the target of all the evidence, that plan will undoubtedly face several obstacles. In addition, Sharon is listening to Cameron Kirsten and all of his evil counsel, which might make things worse for everyone. Because she will be so focused on establishing Sharon's guilt, Cameron may eventually pressure Sharon to identify Phyllis as another victim. Because Phyllis is after Sharon, and because she will always threaten Sharon's happiness with Nick Newman, Joshua Morrow, it's easy to envision Cameron acting as though she has to be fired. We'll see if Phyllis is in danger since Cameron might put pressure on Sharon to get rid of her for good. It appears that Diane Jenkins Abbott will answer Victor Newman's pitch in the interim. Will Diane agree to Victor's recruitment strategy and efforts to win her over to his cause? Victor may believe he can persuade Diane to exact revenge on Jack Abbott, but if her failed marriage is a hoax, there may be problems with that strategy. What if Diane poses as Victor's helper in order to obtain information that will benefit Javit? In any event, according to Y and R spoilers, Jack and Victor's rivalry will intensify, but Victor might be taken aback by how cunning his opponent can be. Given that they obviously share an adversary, Billy Abbott and Jack may eventually even establish an Abbott alliance. On October 29, Nate Hastings will meet with Amy Lewis, and he's curious to know what she wants to say. What big news will Amy be sharing with Nate in person when she makes the special trip to Juno City? Although Amy's secret hasn't been confirmed yet, it appears to be something she's been hiding for some time. There has been conjecture that a new actor could play Nate's half-brother as we know that a casting call for a good-looking black male in his early to mid-forties was held earlier this year. Given that Amy may have surreptitiously gotten pregnant with Nathan Hastings Sr.'s child, it stands to reason that she may have given birth to Nate's half-sibling and desired for them to finally meet. But then again, Amy might end up throwing another curveball. You can expect that Nate will soon receive some startling updates, regardless of what Amy discloses. But in the future, Victoria might let herself fall completely in love with Cole. Victoria might begin to imagine Cole and Victoria's happy ending since Only Claire Newman engagement is and wedding plans to, to proceed. Claire is already hoping that Victoria would ask Cole to move in. 
Jordan might have different plans for Cole and Victoria's love tale, even if they may think it will end happily. It will not be long before Jordan breaks out of prison once more and terrorizes Genoa City once more. Jordan has spent many long hours sitting in prison, contemplating her desire for vengeance. Jordan will undoubtedly continue to pursue Victor and Nikki Newman, but she will not overlook Claire and her betrayal. Victoria and Cole might be in danger if Jordan decides to destroy Claire's reunited family. It's simple to picture Cole as the hero when Jordan makes his second Y and R comeback. Depending on the outcome, Cole may save both Victoria's and Claire's lives. In any event, Cole may suffer severe consequences for confronting Jordan, who has demonstrated her extreme threat. If Cole isn't cautious, he can wind up suffering the same terrible fate as Nikki's previous sponsor, Seth Morgan. When she returns, Jordan will undoubtedly be more determined than ever to wreak complete havoc. Stay tuned for more Jordan predictions and updates on Cole's chances of surviving her upcoming horror show, as there may be some casualties along the road. Here are the spoilers for Thursday, October 24, 2024's episode of The Young and The Restless. Fans can anticipate that Sharon Newman will be forced into a difficult situation in tomorrow's episode. Returning to assist Daniel Romolotti, Jr. with his criminal justice issue is Christine Blair. Additionally, troubling information is revealed to Tracy Abbott. Find out what will happen in the upcoming episode of the CBS soap opera by reading on. Sharon will be cornered, according to Y and R spoilers for Thursday, October 24. Fans remember that Phyllis Summers begged Chance Chancellor on Wednesday's show. Chance also discovered proof in the penthouse that Heather had been murdered. Additionally, Sharon appeared to have conflicting hallucinations of Nick Newman and Cameron Kirsten. But then, at Sharon's door, the real Nick appeared. I can't do this anymore, Sharon remarked, sobbing. Sharon appears on the verge of revealing everything, unless she's stopped by Cameron. According to Thursday, October 24 spoilers for The Young and the Restless, Christine will return to Genoa City. Christine will return to assist the son of Danny Romolotti. Can Christine demonstrate Daniel's innocence? Christine will probably have to demonstrate Sharon's guilt in order to accomplish that. Unless Sharon comes clean and puts an end to this nonsense, of course. Fans will also witness Jack Abbott breaking some unsettling news to Tracy on Thursday, October 24. Tracy is now the one who maintains the family's unity. Will Tracy be able to resolve this major issue with the Abbott family? Even Tracy might not be able to manage the complex situation with Kyle Abbott. The outcome of Amy Lewis's meeting with Nate Hastings may also be seen by fans. Furthermore, what are Audra Charles and Lily Winter's current prospects? It appears that Audra was seeking an alley, but Lily has little interest. However, Audra is adamant about regaining what she lost. Audra may target both the Abbott and Newman families if she is unable to support Blissade. On Thursday, October 24, 2024, which narrative are you most excited to see? What do you think will happen to Amy, Nate, Audra, Jack, and Tracy? For Christine, Danny, Daniel, Sharon, and the other citizens of Juno City, what lies ahead? Thanks for watching if you like this video so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.